How's it going, boys? Do you know what we're gonna be doing today? We're gonna be joining the dark side. Oh yes, and for one simple reason, unlimited power, as Boba Fett would say from the Star Wars prequels. And it's gonna be absolutely amazing. We are playing Mono Red Aggro, and this time, not a meme version. We did play Mono Red Burn previously, but honestly, let's be real, we all know that that was kind of a meme-ish thing to do. But this, this is... True serious try hard mono red aggro and the new version of it is absolutely shameless. What can I say, boys? Because we are using the prowess cards, okay? We're using the new slick shock to show off. This card, whenever you cast a non creature spell, gets plus two, two. It has flying, it has haste. Whoever thought that this is balanced deserves prison time, okay? It's that easy. And we're gonna combine it with more overpower things, like this thing. Now, uh, nowadays, Red is all about that prowess, baby. A goblin rogue that can prowess in haste and has a disguise ability that costs six, but costs one less for each instant and sorcery in your graveyard. And we do have a decent amount of instant sorceries, which means if we ever run out of cards, we can actually do this disguise mechanic which I have absolutely never done once in my life because I'm not a Yu-Gi-Oh player, sadly, but it is what it is. And we are going to be using fun things like, for example, Itali's Favor. Now, this is admittedly a fun thing, but, 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 this is not a meme. This is actually really good. Itali's Favor costs three. It's a plus one, one trample aura. But the big thing is that it discovers three. And you know what discover is? Discover is playing a card. Which means we cast this, this thing gets plus, uh, plus two damage, this thing gets plus one damage, and the Swift Spear also gets plus one damage. Then it does something, and well, the effect triggers again. It is extreme value if you have already an existing board, and arguably this card goes one, for, uh, one damage for one mana, so worst case scenario, it's still pretty good. But in any case, we have so much stuff, Ancestral Anger, Reckless Impulse, even a Felden. This is absolutely true amazingness. Anyway, 20 lanes to be specific, one specific, wow, what a, what a word. 1.5 average mana cost, and with that being said, without any further ado, let's just get a crack in and see what happens. It's going to be absolutely amazing, boys. We could be using some other cards, admittedly, also. Maybe something will change. Maybe I'm gonna remove, uh, you know, Phoenix Hatchling or something. I'm not sure at the moment yet, but I'm, I must say, this does seem pretty on point and whatnot. So I'm kind of excited to see how it goes against the Johnny Avatar. Okay. Again, keep in mind, Mono Red Aggro. Literally one of the most overpowered things in the world. So, you know, fun times. Opponent goes first, says good game, and he is escape tunnels. Oof. Okay. You don't see escape tunnels often. Uh, how do I want to play this? Do I want to go for the show off? I think I do. I think I do. I can go for the show off and then next turn I can probably reckless impulse land and phoenix check. I'm assuming we're going to have three. It never fails. <gasps> Oh no, he has stuff and MacGuffins, which means I'm changing the way I do things. Okay, let's do it like this. In any case, did we go first? No, we went second. Low skill, I know. Let's put the cat on purple soda. 51 cards, okay. I, I thought that that's like 70 cards, okay, good. Cut down! Okay, okay, I see how it is, I see how it is. Not everyone can have a good childhood. And it's very obvious through the cutdowns and whatnot. Another one? Wait, why did you? Oh, because you attacked. <laughs> I'm getting so ahead of myself. I'm, 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 I'm. You know, <laughs> I'm in the next turn already, boys. Not gonna lie. Anyway, what are we gonna do? We're gonna do this. Should we actually maybe plot? Ah, it's equivalent value no matter how we do it, right? Hmm. No, 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 let's do this, let's do this. We, we need to go for the show-off play, okay? It just makes sense at the end of the day. And now we click really fast because I want him to believe we uh, 
Wait, 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 wait. If he uses one more removal, that's also a victory for me. Because keep in mind, this uh, this makes stuff better. Ho oh, ho, baby! Man, what can I say, boys? Cut down fails so often, it's not even... Hello. Um, if you want to draw me cards, you know, I'm completely cheeks for that, chief, you know? In any case, what now? Reckless Impulse? Probably. So, we know he's not just pure. <laughs> oh no! So sad! Oh no! Okay, let's do this. I mean, this is gonna just, just scale out of control, so it's fine. And now I can do this. Actually, I could have also done the other thing. But I don't feel like it's necessary. Uh, he will not be able to... Well, he could technically, Vrat. Technically he could, yeah, for sure. <laughs> or not, you know. Or, or, or absolute big cheese not. Okay, so what are you gonna do there, Chief? I can actually get uh, the Phoenix Chick also out. I can play the Phoenix Chick and get the other Phoenix Chick out. Man, anything he does is kind of weak sauce, weak, weak willed, weak everything. That's why that's why you never choose to be the Ajani Avatar. It's just, you know, kind of reprehensive and uh, that's all she wrote. In any case, let's see what happens now. Do I attack with everything? Eh, close enough. He actually has a Jace with 7. That's that's pretty decent. That's pretty decent. And now the Phoenix check. So he can technically block in a way that he survives with 1 HP. But oh, I mean now he survives with a little bit more HP, but who, who cares? I still have Provis up to Wazoo and he has only 2 HP left. Any play he does is nonsensical. Does this even do anything? You need to flip it first. Oh, I need to discard something. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> two H two man left. Oh. I mean that almost works and does things. Too bad it doesn't. <laughs> okay, let's see how it goes. Anything but a land instantaneously equals big vintage for us, by the way. J -j just instantaneously off the bat. Anything non-land is insta-win. And now he's top decking. But man, that's eight loyalty. Oh, 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 oh. Now, who could have expected that? Honestly, I kind of feel that we maybe need a little bit more of that sweet, sweet uh, removal kajiggers. That would be nice. Maybe. But what do I actually replace then? I, I kind of like, like those lightning strikes, but... What do we put out to put in lightning strikes? I mean, we could technically remove two lands. Technically could, but should we? Uh, let's play one more game and figure out do we actually want to do that. I mean, it's a choice. I can remove one land, then we're pretty safe at 19 considering our average is 1.6, right? And then we just had two lightning strikes and call it a day. Stank Magoo, what a time to be alive. Three la two, la two lands? That's a little bit not much for uh, the classic yet fantastic, whatever this is called. Do I fell Dren? I could just this into this and Monster Strange, but I don't know what my pl Why is my opponent going first, by the way, wizards? When I'm playing against aggro, I specifically always go second. Is this some kind of unfair thing because you don't like me, wizards? Question mark? Is it because you don't invite me to events? Question mark? Is it because you're a, you know, shit tier indie company that, you know, struggles to keep the lights on and your CEO sells cigarettes on the side? Not question mark, that's a dot, that's confirmed. Anyway... So, yeah, let's see. Well, if, if he goes first, I actually know what's better. To do the etchings into Feldren? Or to do the Swift Sphere into etchings? Well, actually, since we have two, uh, two, two cost cards, 
It's probably the etchings one hot. Oh! Oh! Um, what do I do here? A phoenix chick, eh? Well, I guess it is definitely this. So, Fe well, Feldren can't block, which is a problem. Should I try to outvalue him with Monster Resist Fear and Monster's Rage, or are we just gonna... Okay, I guess we're just gonna, like, YOLO 420 blaze it on each other until uh, someone gives. I mean, I'm completely fine with that. I got the etchings, boy. And Feldren is technically... Okay, you see why I want to go first? Because the one who goes first in this matchup has a huge advantage. I could be dead now. Or dead inside. Which is already aptly on point. What the hell is this? If you draw two more cards this turn... Oh, no one cares. The literal card. What a time to be alive. Okay, I need the land. Unless we get a land from this, which would be awkward. But we did not, which is good, actually, in this situation. So, what do we do? Do we just do a setup and go for... I mean, I have a lot here. How much is... Uh, I mean, he's gonna kill me. I kinda need to value him. So, it's kinda interesting. Either you win on going first in this matchup because you have equal amount of things, or you win by just removing your opponent's things with more value, which is redundantly dumb. Aha. Uh -huh. And this is big good, as one might say. Because now, it survives. And yeah, that's that's a lot. That's a hot shock right there, boys. Okay, what do I do? Do I block? I think I do, right? Yep, I probably do. It's not a big deal, honestly. Well, it kind of is a big deal, honestly, to a degree, but as long as I take uh, continue having the advantage, yeah, I'm gonna keep it like this. I know uh, it's kind of risky doing this because he ha because I'm answering. Uh, you're disgusting. Anyway, oh ho oh, oh. ho! What a time to be a time! Ho ho ho! Well, that's kind of not bad. You see, this is this is the thing you can do. Rarely does it honestly work against mono red because big brains, but sometimes it does, and you know you can just win games because of it. And now we can actually aggro him and be on the winning side of the engagement. So how much damage do we need to do? He can't kill us in one turn, that's for sure, because Monster's Rage exists. But can we actually? <laughs> Weakness of the flesh, eh? Okay, that's that's completely fine. What I never liked people who played the Raptor. I think it's kind of completely redundant and useless, but that's fine. Anyway, uh, good game, my dude. I win because reasons, obviously. And that does not matter because we can still do this. Trample goes through, and I'm pretty sure that's enough damage. Then again, I'm playing red. Ah, exactly, almost. Then again, I'm playing red, so it's not like I'm doing math. Or thinking in general, that's not a thing that you should do as red. The idea of playing red is pretty simple. On average, you just, you just don't think, you know? If you can cast a card, it's probably worth casting it, okay? This The, the hardest strategy to learn is red is pretty much the fact that you're gonna have to be using Ultra Instinct. And I know that that's probably not hard exactly for a lot of Magic players. Because, my god, it's, it's showing, you know? But still, also if we get three lands here, we're absolutely cooking with fire. Ooh! Oh, can I go first, please, once in my life? Thank you very much. Huh, do I just act, uh, Omega Pump Monastery, Swift Sphere? By the way, Ankle Biter. Kinda cool, but not cool at the same time. Anyway, I have three lands now, so... I guess I just do this for, uh, a damage pump. That's... Wait, is there a world where he untaps this because there's a bunch of cards that are... Nope. Good. 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 
Okay, so now I play this. Next turn I can play this. I have never tried it, by the way, so I don't really know if it works, but I'm pretty sure a tally can dis uh, discover itself, right? I'm pretty sure a tally should have the ability of just discovering itself, as hilarious as that is. And let's do this. Shabazzle, and let's now do this. More Shabazzle. And I guess I'm just a completely attacking with these two. I think he wants to block, which is fine by me, honestly. If he blocks both, that's, again, fine. He can technically block but Oh, wait. If he block, Oh, you know, you could just die. That's, that's an option. For four mana, you have no way of healing. There's the Basilisk that heals, but that's three mana. So, I don't know what he's doing, but it's, it's not... Whoa! That was the worst choice you could ever make in your entire life on each one. What do you mean? First time I see anyone actually use this. Ninjutsu? Did this turtle ramp or what did this turtle do? I don't even remember. I guess it's completely irrelevant. You may remove a death touch counter from it. Ah, hiccups. Eh? I'm sorry, what the hell did you just do now? Um, sure, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna do it like this, I guess. Doesn't really matter too much. I think I'm still winning like there's no tomorrow because we know reasons. And what do we get? Another one! And it actually procs because, well, I mean, more reasons. <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty good. Again, block it. Block it. Block it with everything. See what happens. You run five mana. It's, it's a little bit... He doesn't block that. That's strange. 3 HP left. I mean, choices were made, that's for sure, but... Are these choices worthwhile? Oh! I mean, that. yeah, that's, that's definitely what you call a worthwhile choice. Okay, so, what do I do now? Well, it's pretty obviously simple. We do this. Trample! What a, what a time to be alive. And now we can do even this. Considering everything has trample, I mean, the good. I, I mean, he's cooked. Everyone literally can see that, right? Omega cooked, in fact. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, that's that's just a little bit of extra. So as you can see, yeah, the Ita uh, the Italy's favors definitely actually achieve stuff here right now. So yeah. Also, how much is this? Three wins in a row. Four wins in a row, maybe? I'm not sure. Anyway, boys. Also, question, question mark time. Some of you are smart in the things that I am not smart on. I am smart at, you know, only three things in my life. And and, and one of them is moving, moving your finger like this. And, well, I guess... I, and then the other one is moving your... Uh, moving your... Moving your thing thing inside here tongue right like that okay so um how bad is it that my, uh, that i got an sms on my phone that asked me to for a confirmation code for an online casino that i did not register for how 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 bad bad is that okay you know from from a scale of one to time to change phone numbers I, I, you know, they, they still asked for the confirmation code, which is nice, but, you know, the fact that someone, someone except me is using my phone number for bad things, not good. So, how much worried should I be? Like, I, can they actually do anything if, for whatever, for whatever reason, is this random? Or what exactly is happening here? So, yeah, I, I'm kind of interested in it. Did I buy gold on World of Warcraft and G2G? Yes! I'm pretty sure G2G is a reputation, a reputable site and whatnot. Also, what the hell is this? I'm assuming it's... Ah, that's bad. Oh no, I could actually outplay this guy pretty heavily now. I got to play with fires. He's turn 3 using the thing that makes something into a 3-4 and discovers 3 when it's killed. 
I really should look into is it just because of that ultra value stuff, honestly. But, you know, for, for now I guess we're doing this. In any case, leave down in the comments. Please don't play a gin. He did it! What the hell is this? Okay, tapping that does... You can't even tap it? Huh, I thought you could. You can tap the planeswalker. Interesting. In any case, uh, yeah, hover cards aside, what's the point of this? Um, should I destroy this? He he has an interaction, so I'm not sure what's, hap what's happening here. I mean, I don't care to take the damage because, honestly, I'm out DPSing him, obviously. But, you know, still... I guess I do this because it's value, so he can't sack the ginger brute. So it's good. So, yeah. The crew one doesn't matter at all. Ho ho ho! Well, now we know what his interaction was, and it was weak. In any case, we're gonna have uh, Itali's favor, which is good. Or, hmm, that's, that's a good alternative, considering everything, honestly. But I think Itali's uh, favor currently is just a little bit better, you know? Mm, yeah, this is not bad. This is free real estate as always. A land. Not good, but not bad. And we're still ahead in the damage department. Huh, so as long as he doesn't drop the three cost card that makes other cards better. Oh, he could have actually targeted the mop, so it doesn't matter. This is not even a misplay. Because you can use it on a creature, or you can use it on an artifact. I don't remember if you could actually use it on an enchantment, though. But yeah, in any case... I wonder what's happening here. Because if it's a pure DPS race, I'm obviously winning. I don't know what just... Well, nothing, it seems like. YOLO. Nice. Okay. Okay. So if you're just gonna crew, that's that's it. That that's that's the grand play. Are you really planning to out DPS me at this point? <laughs> seems seems slightly redundant. Not gonna lie, but if, you know, it's it's your life on each one. I'm getting a lot of lands, which does not make me feel loved by wizards. But then again, nothing makes me feel loved by them. I should I sorcery instant. I mean, I can almost do this, right? I don't know how the skies works exactly, but I can almost do it. Okay, well, whatever. I think we I think we have to go for the push, so, you know, this is fine. We're, we're out damaging him again anyway. This is like 5, plus we can even do a uh, play with fire, so... I th we're definitely on the up and up. Plus, he's using the ugly Kai avatar. Oh, by the way, wizards! When are you implementing the hot Kaya avatar? We currently have this... Oh, look at me. I'm from Horizon Zero Dawn after Ubisoft decided to change their staff with uh, full-blown purple-haired uh, psychiatric patients, okay? When, when are we getting the, you know, good, good-looking good Kaya, the one that's really hot, you know, the three-cost one? Seriously? Is that all your plays, my dude? Anticlimactic as it comes. Oof. Okay, so do I destroy the ginger brute or do I just wait? I'm not even sure. Another one. Sure. Kick knock yourself out, chief. At some point he's gonna have to use the mobs though, which is good. I mean, okay, now he's doing more damage than me, but <laughs> who cares? I still have this, I, st I still have the pizzazz, you know. Okay, he's finally cracking some uh, maps. It's it's pretty obvious. Dude, why do you not use the maps? Oh, he's targeting something. Oh. On the ancient soul! Yeah, yeah, let's go! Die. Okay, good enough. What an absolute disgrace, though, to society this deck is. That is for show, boys, okay? 
Actually, I should have probably disguised this one uh, now because that was probably the smartest choice, but well, you know. Hey, I'm here to win. And well, clearly he is not. <laughs> okay, so what are you gonna do? You're out of car. Well, technically, again, you still have the that, which isn't bad. But what are you gonna do? Not attack me? Well, he can block with the ginger. And he goes for the worst choice, huh? Um, okay. Five, six. He attacks with the ginger brute. Um, yeah, you need to. You could have actually probably won. Oh, now you could not have won because I would just. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I, I, I've been extremely hard here, okay? It, it's fine. It's, it seems like it's fine. Because I could just put the monster strange on anything he decides to block, so it would be fine. Probably would be this, so, you know, it, it is what it is. And he's toast. He's absolutely 100% MacGuffined. I have to say, he survived longer than expected, considering the garbage that he played, but, you know... It happens. <laughs> it happens, it happens. Should have probably, though, played uh, the two cost pro S card in the skies because that would have probably been more value. But, you know, you, 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 you can never predict these situations, right? Okay, do this. Standard rank, let's go. Okay, now it's definitely a minimum of four wins in a row, right? Again, you see what's the... You see how absolutely... Um, the red is just... Well, red is red. Like, King Shark is a shark. And the Riddler needs to be smarter than King Shark for some reason. God, Suicide Squad doesn't make sense. Opponent goes first, once again. Are we ever gonna get to go for... Whoa, Chief, relax. Are we ever gonna get to go first at this rate? He probably doesn't have a way to deal with this flying unit, so... This is good, I think. I don't remember what you do. Ah, things. Yes, yes. It all makes sense now. Anyway. Now, I'm actually gonna go for this because it's the biggest damage right off the bat. And, again, since our opponent goes first because wizards logic... Wait, do you lose if a life each turn? If you control an enchant creature, you lose a Oh! Oh, I remembered this! I thought that it's not bad, but it's a little bit too much of a meme to actually work out. Phoenix chick, uh... Okay, relax. How about, uh... How about them potatoes? Uh, how about, you know, just a slight relaxation here? Well, not that it honestly matters, because again... I am absolutely 100% just, you know... Out-damaging him, like, you know, it just makes sense 8 HP left and you're damaging yourself you can't even cast the Shreldred my dude what now oh he missed a land drop well now he got a land drop nice okay who is this and does hentai of her exist I, I need answers boys okay you know asking for a friend you think he's gonna sack that oh he oh uh, no. <laughs> Pathetic. Anyway. Uh, if I attack with this, do I just win? Six. I don't! Well, need- Well, I uh, know, actually I do. I- I do, because this is, a uh, 100% uh, we draw one damage. We have etchings that deal one damage at this point, And- well, maybe he concedes because he thinks that we have an interaction, I don't know. We have etchings, we, we have so much stuff. We have the play with fire. Well, actually, it's just etchings and play with fire. Which is honestly completely good enough for the situation. So I'm assuming I'm gonna get play with fire because that that's how I feel. Or, you know, not. 
Yeah, what, what, what not? He could kill me if he drops this. But he doesn't? Wicked roll? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. How about you just, you know, go buy a lottery ticket or something? The, the probability of me not getting a kill switch on the block... And the, the chances that he has three of those. L let's relax here a little bit, wizards. I understand I'm a problem, obviously. The best problem, in fact, to have in your life. But, you know, I didn't... Uh, uh, hashtag did not appreciate it. And let me text a little bit. Bam, boys! Let's go! Let's let's go! In any case, let's look at the hand. Good enough. Press keep. Well, the bonuses of play. Oh, oh, we're going first, boys. Is it is is it our time? It's a oh no, it's a pony. That picture. Hmm, that's a curious choice. Well, whatever, that's a lot of damage. And, you know, we went first. A lot of people just concede when they see the etchings because they know it's pointless. <laughs> oh. Well, are you gonna do anything with that? No. But I am, though, on the other hand, actually kinda stumped here a little bit. I'm not gonna play with fire, even though maybe that was the right choice. 9 HP left. He's gonna gain three life here, which is not cools. <sighs> I don't know who you are. Who are you again? Um, you get damage based on lands, let me assume? Enters the battlefield, search your library for the basic desert reveal, put in your head. Then shuffle gets a plus one for each desert you control. Huh? But that's just for the turn. Oh no, it's passive. Oh my. Um, wait, does this oh my even matter? Let me, uh, let me, let me check. Uh, four, six, eight. Hmm. I mean, I have to take, uh, take, uh, take the lick here. <laughs> Five lands, disgusting. Okay, let's see how it goes. Maybe he actually blocks the etchings. In any case, we do this. I'm pretty sure we can get lethal now. Eh, it's cute, but I can't really use it, sad sadly. I need to get one more play with five, then we just, you know, win. Um, that's not honestly that bad, so, you know, at least it's gonna be an option, right? Okay, let's see, and we got... Nothing. Well, again, this this is probably a win on its own, so I'm I'm cool with it. Again, two HP. What up, Buttercup? Well, he could drop this again. Well, no, it's not gonna heal instantaneously, so I'm just gonna say good game. <laughs> Come on, two damage wizards. Is that really so hard? Just pass the. Th Jesus, that's a lot of MacGuffins that are not that useful. Okay. Oh, 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 there we go, there we go, see? Never fails, boys, never fails. What now? Are you gonna counter spell? Uh, no, but that firm does nothing, honestly. Oh, by the way, I have been thinking about this. As, um, uh, flash as long as you control a desert. That's pretty good. And the exile effect. From your graveyard, search your library for a desert card, put it on the battlefield tap. That worm is actually really good. Plus, it's a 6-5 with a flash if you're playing deserts. I haven't looked into deserts, but, I mean, that green card is pretty decent, considering everything. And deserts are basic lands, right? I think deserts were basic lands. Let's actually check. So, deserts should be found by anything. What? How the fuck do you spell desert? Wait, 
Wait, I spelled it correctly the first time, so what's the deal? Oh, so they're not basic lands, huh? Hmm. Oh, they're tap lands. Yeah, they're tap lands. All of them are tap lands, huh? That's not good. Yeah, that's that's not good. Okay, maybe the desert dream is not real because all of them are tap lands. Does the green stompy uh, boy that costs three, does it say it finds a land or a basic land? Ah, it's basic land. Yeah. So, is it possible to use deserts with a ramp effect currently? I don't know. Okay, going first with double etchings. Felden in Monster's Rage. This is way too good to be true. Am I gatekeeping Wrestling Yoda? I hope I am with a name like that. Well, he's at least a real player, it seems like. Why are people using this card bag? It's not even cool. Boys, stop! Stop! Why, why would you be using this card bag? If you can use this card bag and dream about getting smashed by Kioras, Tick, Muscular, Juicy. Mmm. Ties, you know? They're pro that's probably and ironically the best way to ever go out. And, and, and you have the option of just having it there, it there on your sleeve. But you, 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 just, you just don't. I'm so confused. Why, why wouldn't you? Also, is it time to just out aggro this guy? I feel like it is, boys! I feel like it definitely is. Do I cast Monster Strange? Probably not. There's no nothing to gain, really. Okay. I mean, that's a strong start, but you see, this is why you go first, boys. Otherwise, not good. Not good. Anyway. God, I want these dice to smash my head like a melon. That would be amazing. Um, weakness is definitely a thing. Well, even if... You, wait, are you gonna... Do, oh. Oh, my. Cute. Said... Oh, come on! Not again with the lands wizards. Like, come on. Relax, chief. Relax. Um, he does that and he does that. Okay, sure. I mean, Felden's gonna give me some value sauce out of... Uh, out, out anyway, so it's fine. Everything got exiled, you literally got nothing, and I have this bad boy. And I think I'm definitely gonna try this finally. No idea how it works. I'm assuming I just click on it, right? Oh yeah, we have one instant. Okay, so we're drawing cards. <laughs> my, my dude tried really hard, okay? My, 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 my dude right there, yeah. Yeah, that, that's right, shit. <laughs> Meme Lord. Absolutely meme lordish. Okay, so one loss. What is it now? Seven wins, eight wins, something in a donkels like that. Again, every time we play mono red, we we worst worst the uh, worst time that we played mono red seriously, the worst absolute performance we had was a 60% win rate. With mono red. When we play seriously. And by serious, I mean I just use good cards. There is literally nothing happening in my head while playing. Uh, the, oh, uh, are, are we finally down to uh, make him have just just one card? Sure, I'll take it. I'll, I'll, I'll take the challenge, wizards. Do you think I fear you? No, of course not. You have lost already to me in the game of life. In any... Oh! Oh, oh, I mean, we're, we're going, we're, we're going at maximum deep, aren't we here? Okay, okay, okay. I'm probably never getting the second land. Okay, how many t t draws do you think it's going to be? 10, 11, 12, maybe? I think the maximum we have spent on one land... Jesus! Woo, boys, that is just something else. Ah... Uh... I think I do it like this. I'm not sure what he's playing, but he definitely counters this because he has literally all the life gain in the world. 
Do you think he's gonna do the thing for three mana that gives him more life? I mean, would be on... Oh, wedding announcement. I mean, cute, I guess, but no cigar. Need to push in a little bit, so, you know. Oh, wow, still no lands. Damn, no, that's, that's, that's big luck. Oh, he actually goes... Uh, okay, okay, okay. I see, I see. That's pretty good. That's arguably also pretty good. Yeah, I don't like this. Okay, so what do I do now? I do this because this is the land draw, obviously. Um, yeah, from all things unholy... It's not even a land draw? Are you kidding me? Okay, okay, how dead, uh, from one to dead, how dead am I? A lot, it seems like. I also don't think I finished the sentence. Oh, yeah, about the red win rate, yeah. And people ask, uh, pe people ask, how, how, how do you not get metek? Because I don't want to. The last time I wanted to, it uh, roughly, by my estimates, it would have taken me 20 hours of gameplay. And bruh, I am not... Oh, he had the mana! I didn't even see. Well, I am Omega dead. I could have actually won if I had the mana. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh my lord! Literally! Literally all the healing, huh? Okay, chief. Relax. Relax. But yeah. I, needed to, I need to play roughly 20 hours of serious playtime to get Metek. And that is a rough estimate for me, if I try really, really hard, five days. Five days. If I try really, really, really hard to push myself. And needless to say, bruh, I ain't, I ain't doing that. I am absolutely not doing that, okay? I tried, the new expansion came out, you know, I, I did my best, boys. But I don't care about it. It's, it's a joke anyway. They, someone made the bot that plays mono red aggro and just uses the first most available left card in your hand and that's, that's kind of it. And, th and they got mythic. So, you know, I'm, I'm not doing it. It means, it, do it doesn't mean anything. Also, it just pisses me off to see those forced losses because keep in mind, every time you're close to ranking up, Oh, the 50% win rate is so strong when that happens. Oh, this is fu uh, fun. This is a good use of this card, not gonna lie. Unexpected, though, but... Hey, it's almost like the... Crater Hub Behemoth for... I'm gonna steal this, maybe. Who knows? Anyway, it doesn't even matter. Well, any case... This was Quizzer Said 7. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. And have a nice day. Bye bye.